All right, hello, good morning, good evening, and good night. I hope you guys are doing absolutely fantastic because in today's video, what we're gonna be doing is we are going to be estimating some dividends. Now, what I did in previous videos, what we've done is pretty much just only estimated TSOY's dividend, but I understand that you guys probably hold many different yield max ETFs. So in today's video, I have four yield max ETFs we're gonna cover. We're gonna cover TSOY, Kony, AMZ, and also Dizzo, not Lizzo, Dizzo. We are going to be covering all these four yield max ETFs because they go X dividend in a couple of days. I'm not exactly sure when that is, but it's going to be, I'm pretty sure it's actually the seventh. So you want to probably buy in the next couple of days. It's either the seventh or the eighth. Now I don't intend for this video to be long at all. It's going to be a shorter video. I have not looked at the monthly results for each of these stocks. I have obviously their own stocks, Kony, AMZ, and Dizzo and their underlying stocks. So we're gonna go over all that and give you my predictions in this video. But before we do that, I do wanna say, if you haven't yet subscribed, please do subscribe. We're up to 3,526 subscribers. And for the fact of this video, if you guys also wanna comment down below as we go through this together, what dividend yields you think each of these stocks is going to pay, that would be pretty fantastic. I will hope, I will, not hopefully, I will get back to you, period. So, Without further ado, let's get into it. So TSOY currently at a 60% dividend rate. We're gonna start with these ones and then we'll move on to the others. So last month they paid a 58 cent dividend and I pulled up the one month chart for each of the stocks. So we have obviously TSOY and we have the underlying stock being Tesla. Now Tesla over the past month has appreciated pretty nicely from about 220 to about 240. Going to the sixth month, you could see here, the last month had a really big dip to the downside, but for the current month, we had the month of November, we had a pretty good push to the upside. We definitely tested some new boundaries, potentially with Tesla hitting about 250 roughly, 250 roughly. So this could be a bullish trend for the upside for Tesla and for the underlying stock TSOY. Now, what do I think for this dividend? I think the dividend's honestly gonna be pretty similar, about 58 cents or potentially a touch higher. The reason I say that is due to the fact that the underlying stock Tesla is a little bit higher than it was previously and it had a little bit more capital appreciation which should obviously help the share price or sorry not the share price it will help the share price of tsoy but it will also help boost a little bit of a greater dividend yield so i do think it might be slightly bigger than this 58 cent or about that marker now going to the next one coney the yield max coin option income strategy etf current dividend yield about 50 percent 49.68 the recent dividends have been very large over a dollar each now what do i think for this stock coney is a stock that has appreciated really well over the past month look it's a yield max etf that went from 22 dollars all the way up to 26 dollars currently and that's due to the fact that the underlying stock coin is seeing some rapid amazing growth over the past month look at this you're talking about like 40 to 50 percent growth right here from coin now we didn't necessarily capture all that upside uh from coinbase in coiny but we are also going to be receiving a dividend now looking over the past month we see or the previous month we've seen a little bit of growth from october into november well you know what november has been a blistering month of growth for coiny and also coinbase and I do think that this dividend is going to be much larger than 107 or $1.07. I do think it's actually going to be closer to the previous dividend of $1.20. The reason I say that, Kony is at a greater share price than it was previously. And Coinbase experienced a lot more growth in the past month. So I do think that obviously Coiny has a greater distance to fall in terms of their dividend. They could fall to about 20 $24 or $25. So I do think there's definitely going to be over a dollar dividend greater than the last one for Coiny. So that is good if you are a Coiny investor. Anything with Coiny has been pretty awesome to this point. So let's let's just agree on that. So going to the next one, we're talking about AMZ, the Amazon Yield Max ETF. Now, AMZ sitting at about $21. I haven't looked over it at all really over the past month. So now I'm seeing they're, they're pretty flat for the most part. They experienced a tiny bit of growth over the past month, but been relatively flat. The underlying stock, Amazon, pretty much the same thing, a slight uptrend, but relatively flat. Now we could see that from October to the start of November, they experienced some pretty good growth. And we should probably see that reflected in their dividend share price, which we do not clearly, 
with the dividend actually going down from the previous month from 63 cents down to 54 cents. Now, what do I think will be for the next month? I do think this dividend is going to be higher than 54 cents. Amazon, as you can see here, or sorry, AMZ. Uh, yeah, let's go Amazon. So you can see here about November 2nd, November 1st, there has been a great run up from about $138 to about closer to $150. So a $12 run up in the stock price of Amazon, which obviously will contribute to AMZ and their dividend. That is that kind of volatility there. And it's all in an uptrend. It's all in capital appreciation. And so I do think that this dividend is going to be larger than 54 cents for Amzi. That is my opinion. Obviously, it's not set in stone. This is just a guy on YouTube and I'm sharing my advice what I think the dividend might be. Now, the last one, Dizzo. And the reason why I actually brought up Disney is because I've been investing so much in TSOY. This is the only yield max ETF that I actually own, but there's so many others out there and you guys do a great job in the comments of reminding me that there's more yield max ETFs than Tesla. So you know what? For this next month, I'm thinking of starting a position in a stock other than TSLY. And I'm not going to necessarily give any hints, but I have a feeling it's going to be one of these three, either Kony, Amzi, or Dizzo. That is definitely a hint. But let's get into it. Dizzo actually surprised me. Look at this, guys. They're paying a 41% dividend yield. That's flying totally under the radar, totally behind TSLY and Kony. Only a few percents behind, 41%. So let's see what the recent dividend yield was. Now, their first dividend payment was 26 cents. The second one was 72 cents. Over the past month, they've kind of been relatively flat. They hit a little bit of a high period and then retracted down a little bit. Now, we've seen in the previous month, they had a really good run up, actually. Uh, you know what, actually? No, the the November month was a great run up. Dizzo might be the stock that I might look into, not going to lie, because look at this run up right here. They had a great run up in Disney. And was that reflected really? That wasn't it was a little bit reflected in the stock price of Dizzo, but I do believe that they did not capture all of that in the 72 cent dividend. I actually think this dividend is going to be higher than 72 cents for the next month. Could Dizzo be the stock that potentially has a greater yield than Kony, if it does pay a higher dividend, I think that would be pretty cool. Or even maybe not TSOY at 60%, but I think it could potentially trump Kony, not in capital appreciation currently, but maybe in this dividend yield if they were to pay higher than 72 cents. Just going off the past month and seeing, wow, from November 1st, they were trading at about $83 and now they're trading at about $92. I understand they went down a little bit, but that is a pretty good run up that is about a 10 to 15 percent run up right there so that should hopefully be reflected in that dividend i think it's going to be higher than 72 cents so with all that being said that was kind of my dividend yield predictions for and dividend announcement predictions for tsoy coney amzi and also dizzo not lizzo disney the disney yield max option income strategy etf so i hope you guys did enjoy please do remember to subscribe we're obviously at 3,526 subscribers. Let's get that up, guys. But you guys always do a great job, so I'm not worried at all. And the comments, keep them rolling in. Let me know what you guys think about my predictions or your own predictions about Kony, TSLY, AMZ, Dizzo, or any of the Yield Max funds that you think will pay a nice dividend this month. So with all that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy. Please do take care, and I will see you guys in the next one.